Welcome back to another episode of What's Happened. This is our second episode for this segment and also the second month of being in the semester. We hope all of you are doing well and staying safe. Here's what happened in October. We all love a challenge, especially when prizes are involved. On the 1st to 23rd of October, ePals had done 10 challenges in the peer-assisted learning support platform where they gave away 100 prizes ranging from hoodies to t-shirts and even notebooks. It was back to online for all of us this month as the Ministry of Higher Education announced closure of universities and face-to-face classes due to the recent spike in cases. Luckily for us, a wide variety of tips and talks were given out this month to help us, from survival hacks on RBL by student support services, academic writing, focusing on productivity with online learning, and even study tips posted on our Instagram. Toastmakers Club also collaborated with Isaac to give a talk to help students on creating an impactful design thinking and presentation skills. October, as you know, is known for being Breast Cancer Awareness Month, but it's also the month of World Mental Health Day. To break down the wall of stigma against mental health, Hannah, whom says the VP of Wellbeing, did a video which is on our channel, so check it out. To commemorate the upcoming Home Cup, we posted some throwback picture of last year's Home Cup on our Instagram. And soon after that, list of events for Home Cup were also released for this year. Due to CMCO, only online games such as PUBG, Cisco, and Dota were carried out this month. A global What's playlist was launched on Spotify for Hairit What students from all campuses to share their songs. And our What's Happening video, where we met the people behind the scenes, also came out, which is a fun watch, so go watch it if you haven't already. It's a two-part video, and the second part just came out. October is also known as the spooky season. Although we can't celebrate Halloween this year, a murder mystery game night series was executed for all you thrill-loving spooky people. I would say this is definitely a killing success with lots of people joining and many positive feedbacks. If you haven't heard already, Biosecitar, a social enterprise startup by a group of Harriet Watt students, had gotten 4th place in Judges Selection Award and 3rd place in Public Selection Award for Magix University Startup Challenge. So a big congratulations for this big achievement. That's what happened this month. Thank you for watching and we'll be back with another recap soon. Till then, stay safe and see you in the next video.